When cancer is detected early, the outlook for treatment and recovery is better. But with ovarian cancer, it's a little tricky. Symptoms are easily missed and can go undetected for years. That's why women aren't usually diagnosed until the cancer is fairly advanced. But understanding the symptoms better can help you know when it's time to talk with your doctor. Symptoms can be subtle early on, but there are four common ones. Changes in bowel habits like constipation and diarrhea, pelvic pain or pressure, a frequent need to urinate, and bloating or abdominal swelling. Unlike other cancers, there isn't a routine screening. Diagnosis typically begins when your doctor suspects symptoms may actually be caused by ovarian cancer. They'll likely start with an ultrasound and blood work. And then other imaging tests might be ordered, like CT, MRI, and PET scans. After diagnosis, the stage of the tumor is determined through a biopsy and often requires surgery. Understanding its stage is crucial in planning the treatment path. In stage one ovarian cancer, tumors are found on one or both ovaries. In stage two, tumors have spread to the fallopian tubes and the uterus. In stage three, tumors have spread to the abdomen. And in stage four, tumors have spread to other organs. Your doctor will develop a treatment plan that takes into account the cancer's type, stage, and grade, as well as your age and general health. They'll likely plan a combination of surgery, which involves removing the ovary and fallopian tube, chemotherapy. After surgery, it's used to kill any remaining cancer cells and reduce the risk of recurrence, and targeted therapies treatments that interfere with specific steps in the growth of cancer. An ovarian cancer diagnosis can feel overwhelming, but know that treatments are improving, and so are survival rates. Early detection is key, so if you suspect symptoms, it's important to share them with your doctor.